Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm sharing my laundry routine. If you are new to my channel, welcome. I'm so excited to have you here. My name is Roxanne. I am a full-time mom to a one-year-old little boy. So the first thing I always do is separate clothes into seven different categories. Baby clothes, pants, t-shirts, undergarments, towels, pajamas, and sweaters. I am renting, so I have a very small washer and dryer, so I have to keep all the clothes in a small amount, or else it just overflows and nothing gets washed. So I wash the baby clothes first. This has been something I've been doing since he was born. I like having his clothes separated from ours while being washed. So the laundry detergent I'm using is the Mrs. Meyers Lavender Scent. I got this on Grove Collaborative, and if you're interested, I'll put this in the link below. After the baby clothes are done, I can now switch them off to the dryer and I can start washing my undergarments and t-shirts together. Since this washer is too small for three clothes, I do end up washing all day. So there are times I would have to finish washing the next day. My towels are always the last day to get washed aside from my bed sheets. My bed sheets will have to normally wait until the weekend only because they are a lot heavier and a lot bigger for this washing machine and dryer. So the laundry mat will have to be the one place I would have to take them. Now the clothes are dried, I will start to fold my son's clothes. We are sharing a room with him, again. <laughs> um, one of Joseph's friends is living with us. He needed a place that would be closer to work, so we offered him um, my son's room. So we gave up my son's room for him to stay in and live in, and we moved everything into our room. So we are organizing as much as we possibly can, getting rid of things to fit my son's stuff in here. Um, hopefully once our lease is over, we will move into a bigger house that has more rooms. <laughs> that way our son does not end up winding up in our room again. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, I love my son to death. Um, it's just that I prefer him to have his own space rather than having to share a space with his parents, you know? so. You know, that's what I really want for him is just to have his own room so he can decorate and be in and that way I don't have to share. Okay, so now it's just a cycle of doing the same thing over and over. Putting the clothes in and out of the washer to the dryer. And after all the clothes are finally done, <laughs> I can now move on to hanging and folding the clothes. So we're just going to jump right into folding the clothes and hanging them. That way you don't have to see the same process over and over. You get it. <laughs> I don't have a laundry basket to carry the clothes, so I just grab as much as I can and I throw them on the bed and I start folding. I wanted to let you guys know I will be uploading on Thursdays or Fridays now, so be sure to stick around for more cleaning videos such as this one. One little trick I do is I lay out all the t-shirts on top of each other and I would slide the hangers to each of them like this. That way I'm not hanging one at a time. This saves so much time. I don't have enough hangers so I would need to go out and buy some more. But I do fold my pants, my leggings, and shorts and those all go into the dresser. So that completes my laundry routine. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you guys in my next video.